For more videos on people's struggles, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. On December 28th, Chilean police violently repressed a gathering of progressive groups that were commemorating the one-year anniversary since the death of Mauricio Freles at the hands of the police in Santiago. Protesters had gathered near the site of the death of Mauricio Freles, who was a participant in the mass protests in Chile in 2019. According to his friends, Freles was a member of the First Line, a group of protesters which acted as the first line of defense against the Carabineros and their violent attacks during the demonstrations. While fleeing the police, Freles fell into a pit which had energized cables and water. The legal medicine service confirmed that his death was caused by asphyxia by immersion. The protesters who had gathered to protest the one-year anniversary of his death were water cannoned by the Chilean police. According to local media reports, the police have been spraying water with toxic chemicals against the protesters. Dozens of protesters suffered skin irritation and burning due to the same. The protesters also demanded the release of prisoners who were arrested for taking part in the massive anti-government protests last year. The protests, which started off in October 2019 against the hike in the metro fair, soon translated into a nationwide movement against the government. According to reports, between October 2019 and March 2020, 31 protesters were killed, 11,389 were arrested, and 3,838 were severely injured. Today, human rights organizations estimate that around 2,500 people are still being held in prison. Yeah,